So, I, I don't know what's going on. I This team is pretty solid. I, at least, I think so. I'll, I'll let you guys be the judge of that. But, um... Ugh, I'm just doing so bad. It's so bad. Uh, what are you gonna do? You know? Oh, hey, puppy. I can't help you right now. I can't help you. Um... I'll just play better. That's all I have to do. So it looks like we've got a Tarakion, a Rotom, a Sableye, that's not a Sableye, a Salamence, a Gardevoir, a Talonflame, and a Heatran. Um, honestly, I kind of just want to start off with Rhyperior, um, Mr. Mime. I think that's a pretty solid lead for us. As long as he doesn't start uh, with Rotom. Uh, I'm going to bring Ferrothorn in the back because I think that's going to be pretty... Eh, actually, no, let me take that back. I'm going to bring a little color in the back. Um, and I'm going to bring Charizard. Right? No. Let's not bring Charizard. Let's actually bring Ferrothorn. Yeah, no. Let's, let's not bring Charizard. The reason I'm not bringing Charizard is there's nothing it hits super effectively except for the Rotom, which I've got Ferrothorn and Sable... And, and, why, am I, why am I stuck on Sableye <laughs> and um, Ludicolo? Four, so I guess there's really no point in bringing Charizard. Um, so we are gonna see Tarakion and Rotom. That's a little unfortunate, but I can at the very least get Trick Room up here. Um, I might actually, you know what? Screw it. I'm just gonna protect with my my Rhyperior, and we're gonna get Trick Room going. Uh, the reason being is I can live without Rhyperior. Um, so if I can kill the Tarakion. Um, I can sack off my Rhyperior and not worry too much, uh, whereas I just, I really can't, I don't want to be too concerned about switching in, yeah, yeah, that's ex that's exactly what I was worried about. I did not want to switch into a close combat with my, my Ludicolo, um, so I'm glad I didn't, I'm very glad I didn't. We get Trick Room up, I'm going to just double into, like I said, to this Tarakion, we're going to go for Dazzling Gleam, we're going to go for Drill Run, um, Tarakion is the thing that I'm most concerned about fighting. I don't care if he takes out my Rhyperior with his Rotom. Not a big deal for me. Uh, it will be if he switches out into like Salamence here. Uh, not as big because I could just then bring in Ludicolo, which is not too bad. Uh, so we don't miss the drill run, that's gonna go off. If he's not wearing Sash, which he is, which is why I went for Dazzling Gleam, I was gonna say it does a little bit more to the Rotom. But, um, Rotom actually goes first before my Mr. Mime, which is interesting. And that didn't look like it was going to KO me. I was like, that's sort of surprising. But, uh, we should definitely be able to take out the, the Tarakion here. And we do. Beautiful! Um, actually, that was some decent damage off onto the Rotom. That was about a, a four-hit KO. That's not too bad. Um, so I'm going to obviously bring in my Ludicolo here. Uh, we'll see what he brings in next. But I think Ludicolo had the best matchup in general. Except for- oh, actually, no, I have Hydro Pump. What am I talking about? Yeah. No, no, that's actually a really good matchup for us. So I'm gonna Hydro Pump, and I'm gonna go for a... He's just gonna go for... no, I'm gonna go for Dazzling Gleam. Yep, Hydro Pump gets off. I've been landing all my Hydro Pumps, which is very shocking. Uh, that's... wow! Oh, I almost- I, I- I was this close! I, I don't know if you can see that. I was this close to actually going for, um, uh, uh, um, a wide guard on that turn. Uh, but that's okay. So we got the Dazzling Gleam off. It's obviously not going to do anything to that Heatran. Um, but I think I could just straight up go for another, a, a wide guard this turn and then Giga Drain the Rotom just to get my HP back. Um, because I'm not too concerned about that Heatran. So I'm gonna go for a Giga Drain onto the Rotom, because he's, he's annoying me. And I'm gonna go for a, no, not a Quick Guard, a Wide Guard. And that should be able to, yes! I mean, it's not great because I didn't attack, but at least, at least I'll get some damage off into this Rotom, you know? Um, so Giga Drain comes off. Oh, I just get all the damage off into that Rotom. Okay, um, I'll take it. I'll take it definitely. Um, so let's see what comes in next. I'm hoping it's Salamence, because that's going to be beautiful for me. Uh, and I, could just, I just need to get another Hydro Pump off onto that Heatran. Um, blah, 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 blah. He's not going to go for another Heat Wave now. Uh, Talonflame? No, I'm going to go for Quick Guard. And Hydro Pump the Talonflame. So let's go for a Quick Guard. 
Oh, this is this is interesting. Uh, I'm not happy that he brought the Talon Flame, but I don't have anything for that Heatran if he kills my Ludicolo, so I have to kill the Talon Flame. Um, I have to. So he does go for the Brave Bird. Obviously, it's going to protect. Do I land it? I don't land it! No! But he Earth's Power is my Mr. Mime, and I don't think that will take me out. So I at least get another turn to try and take out this Talon Flame as best as I can. Um, Trick Room ends, but that's still fine. I'm still going to go for the Hydro Pump Quick Guard. Uh, I don't really have much of an option. I'm upset that it missed, but there's not much I can do about that. Um, he might just go for, like, Flare Blitz and a Heat Wave, which would suck. No, he still goes for the Brave Bird. And he goes for the Earth Power onto the Mr. Mime. Okay, so... Not a great place to be in. If I miss this Hydro Pump, that's game. 100%. No. Okay, good. Um, okay. It looked like he was going to survive. I was like, no, what are you doing? You're a Talon Flame. <laughs> Stop screwing around with me, guys. All right, so um, he's going to obviously go for Heat Wave. Um, and if I, again, miss a Hydro Pump, <sighs> it's going to be game. Because uh, his Heat Wave did a lot of damage to me. I'm definitely the wrong Ludicolo. So Hydro Pump, I only have five more of these, and um, I'm gonna protect just in case. Just in case I miss. This way I have at least somewhat of a fodder to go for like a Leap Seed, maybe. Um, in, in, if, in, in case I miss this Hydro Pump. Um, oh, I can miss another one. I, ca I can miss another one. It's not good that I'm missing, but I can't, I'm allowed to miss at least one more, I think. I can miss this one. He's not going to kill me with... Oh, no. He'll kill me with another heat. Oh, I can't miss this one. I can't miss this one. Ludicolo avoid. Okay, so I can miss this one. That's, that's redemption right there. Um, no, oh, this... I, I would have won, like, two turns ago. But let's see. Let's see. Come on. Yes. That's game. That is game. Good. I'm so happy. <laughs> oh, man. Um, yeah, that... that I think... This team synergizes really well. Mr. Mime, I really like as a setter. It's not as bulky as using, like, Aromatisse or Dusclops or Porygon 2. Um, but it really does work. It supports what it needs to support, and it does it well. You know, I can safely... Like, that turn where the Tyranitar switched in on the Solar Beam, I could just stay in, because I have the Wide Guard, you know? Um, so that's actually not too bad. I appreciate you guys watching. It's really awesome. So thank you guys so much for watching, and I hope to see you guys in the next episode. Peace.